in this video we are going to show you inside look of the click 2.0 and all the features that they have in cf 2.0 and we will also show you how to set up your domain name how to set up your kim keys even if you don't know what dkim is and how to build your first funnel with complete email automation so by the end of this video you have your up and running first funnel is ready to launch and ready to generate lead for you on automation so without further ado let's start the video if you see some value in this video make sure you subscribe to our channel and hit the like button as you can see we are in the cf 2.0 members area and you can see this is the dashboard of cf 2.0 and the right hand side is the welcome area where you can see where you can take the steps you need to take to getting started with ClickFunnels 2.0 so here are basically six steps this year in first step they welcome you and in the second step they talk about funnel hubs and how to build funnel hub and the benefit of the funnel hubs and in the third step they want you to set up your blog and the fourth step is to create your first course and the fifth step is set up your funnels workflows email products and more and the last and the sixth is the set up your payment gateway so as we know we are here to build our first funnel today in this video so in order to build our first funnel today we have to set up your domain name so let's set up your domain name first you need to click on sites and funnels then you need to go to domains then so there are two options now first is to buy a domain name or second is to connect existing domain so in case you don't have a domain you can buy here by clicking buy domain it will take you to this page where you need to enter your domain name whatever you want in my case it's ajitiger.com for example and press enter then it will show you so many other examples ajitiger.co.in and so on so the next you need to do is click on buy what buy button whatever domain you like as you can see it's a indian currency and it will show you your country currency so pro tip here is also opting for google workspace here it's the easiest and the best way to use your business mail into Gmail. So you can check out here by clicking the checkout button. It will take you to the checkout page where you can buy your domain. For just in case you have a pre-existing domain that you want to connect with ClickFunnels 2.0, then click on connect existing domain. It will take you to the page where all you have to do is enter your domain name and hit continue. Then it will show a window like this then click on add domain it will take you domain name providers that you already have it doesn't matter which one you have or it may be a google domain or a name chip in for my case it's a name chip domain so let's start domain setup click on the start domain setup and you as you can see that connect your domain to your website you are a few step away from setting up your domain it's secure and easy just press on continue button it will analyzing your domain and detecting your dns provider getting you set up your setup is ready to go all you have to do is it could be a godaddy domain or namecheap or google all you need to do is log into your google or godaddy or bluehost whatever your domain host provider is all you need to do is log into them and hit Namecheap says verify your identity there an email with verification code was sent to your inbox too so just check your domain check your email and copy and paste your verification code here and hit authenticate it will take some time all right we detected the existing records at rgtiger.com and please confirm that you would like to update these records okay continue setting up your domain hang it there that could be take up to 60 seconds okay boom it's done ajitiger.com is now configured change typically takes less than few hours to go live however it can take up to 48 hours for most cases it does in few hours also so click on done as you can see a, a configuration is on process we are now waiting to confirmation that your domain setup progress has been successfully installed and so this may take 24 to 48 hours as we know so let's click on domains again as you can see i have already connected a domain for example after your domain is verified they show 
everything looks great and healthy and connected to so when your domain is connected all you need to do is click on marketing and click on dkim keys and as you can see okay okay let's delete this again all you need to do is add a new dkim key it will help you to send emails to your customers as you can see i also have a course funnel challenge.com verified dns record verified let's click here after verification your dkim keys it shows a green tick here then you can use your domain names to send emails to people so let's add a new dkim key from here as you can see you don't need to add your www dot here all you need to do is enter your domain name without www dot click on create dkim keys as you can see dkim was key was successfully generated the next step is to set up your dns records so in case it will may take my last domain it will take me to six days to get verified here so let's start a dkim setup here the click on D start dkim setup and connect your domain to your website secure and easy can press on continue analyzing your domain name most people skip this part but you need to do this again logging to your account and hit continue i think it will authenticate again so they will send me an email for verification code yes they will send me an email of verification code let's wait let's enter your verification code and press continue again and let's see you don't have to worry dn dkim keys may take up to six or seven days they will definitely show us it will take 48 hours or 98 hours but it will make some cases it will take more than 90 hours for in my case yeah as you can see ajitiger.com is configured change typically takes less than few hours to go live however it can it can take up to 48 hours but don't worry it may take more than that so press on done so after your verification is done as i also show you you all you need to do is click on your domain and hit verify and we are unable to con contact your domains so after 48 hours or 90 hours when you hit verify it will get verified automatically like this and shows you the green tick like dns records verified and after that all you need to do is set up your workflows or broadcast emails templates and so on so as you can see meantime we build our first funnel click on site and funnels then click on funnels then i also share a link to this funnel that we are going to build today you can import it to your clickfunnels 2.0 account for free as a bonus from my side all you have to do is click the link and it will take you the to the page if you are already login it will automatically import it into into your clickfunnels account if you do not have clickfunnels account you can create one from there too so let's build a funnel click on new lead funnel as you can see you also have a pre-built funnel here so click on edit you can preview it here so click on edit button here now we are in the click funnels 2.0 editor let's see what's here as you can see here is a layout and here is my assets pop-up code setting you can change here your backgrounds and typography or editor settings you can see mobile view here where you can redo or undo here so let's see all you have to do is change the image here like click on settings you can change your image here by uploading or you can drag and drop here so let's see you also have a pre-built funnel here it's already set up all you have to do is change your headline here your sub headline here your button cta text here you just need to update your privacy policies and your firm name and the facebook disclaimer is also here so all you have to do let's see if you build it from scratch how you can do it so there are three things here first is add section first is section you can see like wide and then is the column there are so many types of columns here as we want here as you can see we use two column row here so let's build two column and as you can see you can drag and drop here like this and the image is here like this 
and as you can see input as you can see you can see button here you can drag and you can drag and drop a button here there are basically three type three things here number one is green row is a section number second is the row and all of these are the elements image element you can see headline input cta button element and so on as you can see you can delete it here like this uh, or you can clone it here like this and you can edit it here like this so as you can see let's say what first is not required as you you can type it here name and you can adjust it and you can adjust padding here so this is basically it and you can add another another row like this and add for your policy and disclaimers so these are basically and you can add an element here sub headline here and sub headline again here and that's all we only use these elements here so you can delete it here like this and you just need to add it according to your brands and your copy you can change images as i also already shown you here and you can edit these you can say free pdf download here as same you can edit headline all you have to do is click on button settings and you can change your text here you can scroll to the down scroll down and you can change your background here you can change your text color here you can change the font and the size everything is pre-built for you all you have to do is change the colors the theme is okay you all you need to change your copy and your image inserted here then rest is okay and if you want to change your background color you can change it here like this you can add image i already shown you how to add an image so and you can change the background color from here and if you do not want the background color if you like this you don't need to do anything all you have to do is just editing these and after editing these as you can see let's see click on lead funnel okay we do not want to change anything from here so just we edit your opt-in page as same you can edit it you can edit your thank you page too like this you can change the headline settings here you can do this you can there are so many different things you can do here you can change the phone size from here you can change this according to you you can change your, the color from here you can add in background color here if you want you can change the shadow if you want there are so many different things so all you have to do is edit according to you and according to your brand rest is okay so that's all your lead funnel is built and ready now you can add your domain name from here and you can change the name of your lead funnel here you can change it to a live mode or in test test mode and hit update you can discard changes you can archive this funnel if you want from here so that's basically it for the lead funnel hope you enjoyed the video if you like it make sure you like the video and if you want to set up your domain and the css of it or you want us to set up for you or you want us to build funnels for you you can reach out to us at support at rjtiger.com so if you want to learn more about click funnels and how to edit pages and funnels inside click funnels make sure you subscribe because we are gonna give away free courses for complete setup walkthrough of click funnels 2.2 so make sure you subscribe thank you